Welcome to Purdue FAQ's Boilermakers Respond. I'm your host, Erin Anderson. Today, we're talking about one of the biggest questions incoming Boilermakers have, campus dining options. And to get you the inside scoop, I'm gonna be talking with Alicia, a Purdue Dining and Culinary Senior Brand Ambassador. Alicia, would you mind introducing yourself? Hi, so nice to meet you. My name is Alicia Oshlinski. Um, my major is food science, and I'm a senior here at Purdue, so I'm graduating this spring. I'm from Valparaiso, Indiana, so about an hour and a half away. And I love being a Boilermaker because there's so many opportunities here on campus, so many great people, and it's just been a really great experience so far. So let's get started. You know everything there is to know about Purdue Dining. How would you rate Purdue Dining overall? I think Purdue Dining is such a great place for students to go to. I personally love it. I have a lot of great memories there um, all throughout my years at Purdue and so many great options and you just can't go wrong. <laughs> yeah, never can go wrong with food. What are some of the best places to eat on Purdue's campus? I would have to say Wiley Dining Court, especially if, if you're in the mood for like a home-baked meal or fresh mac and cheese is the best. <laughs> I also love One Bowl, which is located in Meredith, and they have smoothie bowls or salad bar, um, really good stuff. Uh, opportunities are endless. Mm -hmm. What kind of vegetarian and vegan options does Purdue have? So every dining court has those options available, um, but Windsor Dining Court specifically is definitely the best place to go if you um, want that large variety of options. They really cater to those students really well. That's really great. What kind of healthy eating options does Purdue offer? We actually work with a registered dietitian to make sure that every dining court has balanced and healthy options. But my favorite place to go when I'm in the mood for something really fresh and delicious is probably Sushi Boss because I feel like sushi is just so refreshing. You can <laughs> add so many veggies on it. You can also have um, sushi bowls is what they make as well. So that's really yummy. Oh yeah, absolutely. What is your favorite go-to food in Purdue's dining halls? Probably the ramen bar in Hillenbrand. Really good. Um, they only have it on like select nights, so you have to check the app to see when it's going on, but you can add so many different things in your ramen bowl and just make it really fun. How many dining halls does Purdue have? Purdue has five dining halls. There's Ford, Earhart, Windsor, Wiley, and Hillenbrand, all located throughout campus, so it's convenient for wherever your dorm is located. But we also have so many other different uh, retail locations and on-the-go spots where you can pick up a meal as well. Awesome, so many options. What is the best meal plan here at Purdue? So Purdue actually has five meal plans, um, and each one caters to different students' needs. But the best value one is gonna be the 21 plus 500. You get 25, 21 meals per week plus $500 in dining dollars. Awesome, so many great options mm -hmm. for every person here at Purdue. What are Purdue dining dollars? So dining dollars are something that come with your meal plan, and they're already lo they're already um, loaded onto your Purdue ID card when you come to campus, and you can use them to buy like beverages, snacks, meals, convenience items at any of the retail locations, restaurants here on campus or markets. Awesome. What are some of the Purdue dining hall hours? The dining hall hours vary per dining court. Um, so the best place to go is to check the Purdue dining app, and you can see specifically when the dining courts are open for a different day, and they also notify you when the hours change. Awesome. What is the best time to eat if I don't want to wait in line? So that's definitely a good time to check the app. Um, obviously, get there right when they open is probably the best way to go. But also, certain dining courts are open during, like, in between meal times. So if you're in class for later or you um, just are hungry later in the day, uh, just check the app and see which dining court is open in those off hours. That's good information mm -hmm. to know for sure. Are there any late night dining options? The best option for a late night snack is definitely to go to the Boilermaker Market located in Harrison Hall or Cary Quad. Um, also the Harrison Grill, also located in Harrison Hall. Um, all those are open until 1 a.m. So definitely. Awesome. What if I'm tired after a long day of classes and just want to eat in my room? What do I do? What's great about all the dining courts is you can ask to have your meal to go. So when you're about to swipe in line and go into the dining court, you can ask for a to-go box instead. And you can just go around, fill up your to-go box, and bring it back to your dorm. Really great option, for mm -hmm. sure. Is there a way that I can see what the dining courts are serving ahead of time? I would definitely download the Purdue Dining Menus app. 
Um, they show everything that's going to be on the menu for every different lunch hour or dinner or breakfast that's going on. Um, also, I would follow our Instagram, Facebook, Purdue Dining. We definitely post some very high quality content. Not only is it informative and up to date, but it's also really fun to watch. Always super fun to watch. Thank you so much for joining us for Purdue FAQ's Boilermakers Respond. And thanks to all the Boilermakers who gave us the inside info on Purdue's on-campus dining options here in West Lafayette. Do you have a question about campus life that you want answered? Let us know in the comments. Be sure to follow Purdue University for new episodes. We'll see you next time. Boiler up.